Hi children, welcome to today's class. Today we are going to see our new chapter 12 Exponents and Powers. This is very easiest topic, you know well. Last year itself we have seen this using some formula. Okay, about this only we are going to see. Actually why we have chosen this topic? Why, what is the use of this topic for reading? That and all we are going to see. Actually the exponents and powers is used for reading and writing the numbers easily. Reading and writing the numbers easily using the powers. Nothing but exponents. What is the spelling for exponents? E-X-P-O-N-E-N-T. Exponent. Exponent nothing but power. Okay. A very large numbers and all we can't read uh, and write easily using this exponents and powers we can write them easily simplify calculate in easy manner okay so that only we are using this topic it is very very easiest one only okay before going to see just i'm introducing what is exponent how to write bigger number in uh, exponential form see for example about this we have seen side by side in cube and uh, cube root square and square roots itself at the time also i have say, uh, recalled some formula uh, related this exponents and powers just to see here see 2 2 can be written as 2 power 1 2 square means actually 4 can be written as 4 can be written as like this. Yes or no? 2 into 2. See ma? 4 can be written as 2 into 2. The 2 can be written in the exponential form. Actually this form is called exponential form. What is it? Called 2 square. 2 raised to the power 2. Okay. This is this formation is called an exponential form. What is that? Exponential form. Here 2 is the base this 2 is the power or exponent power or exponent 2 square 2 raised to the power 2 uh, simply for square uh, to power 2 we can tell specifically 2 square suppose 3 power 4 actually this is in dash form exponential form here 3 is called base 4 is called exponent. E X P O N E N T. Exponent. Understood, children? 3 power 4. What is that meaning? 3 can be written uh, in a product way up to 4 times. What is that meaning? 3 can be written in product notation up to how many times? Up to 4 times. 3 power 4. Nothing but 3 into 3 into 3 into 3. Clear? In that, 3 is called base, 4 is called its exponent. Understood? That formation is called exponential form. What is it? Exponential form. Here we have uh, negative powers also sometimes will come. Negative powers. How we can tell negative power? See 1 by 10. T see this is 10, this is 1 by 10. Both are not equal. You know well. This can be written as 10 power 1. Here how do you write this? 1 by 10 can be written as 1 by 10 power 1. Here power is that means exponent is positive power plus 1. Suppose this can be written this fractional form I no need. I want in the whole number category. How in which way we can write? At that time, this 1 by 10 can be written as 10 by 1. Denominator, no need. So, 10 power minus 1. Understood children? What I am trying to tell? Powers, uh, powers with the negative exponent I am trying to explain here. What is that? Powers, see, here negative power is occupied. How can be written that? See, actually the number is in fraction. 1 by 10. Here this power is 1 time, 10 is occupied here 1 time, 1 into 10, okay, 10 power 1, 10 is coming in denominator place, so a positive power, 10 power 1, I want to write that number in whole number category, not in fractional wise, so what I am going to do in which way I am going to alternate that means, 
by changing that positive power as the negative power how i am going to change that if we change this positive power into negative it become the whole clear 1 by 10 power plus 1 can be written as 10 by 1 10 by 1 the whole power minus 1 usually 1 power minus 1 become 1 only so here we no need to consider so it can be written as like this understood 10 power minus 1 see again one more example see here 10 can be written as 10 power 1 100 how do you write 10 into 10 no so 10 square 1000 how do you write 10 into 10 into 10 so 10 cube okay here if you consider the base base are same 10 10 10 what are, uh, what, uh, what are their exponents 1 2 3 all are positive exponents what are that all are positive exponents negative exponents means how it comes see 1 by 10 that means 10 power positive 1 in the denominator that to be changed uh, taken to numerator means how can be written 10 power negative 1 10 power minus 1 understood negative power with the negative exponent see 1 by 100 how do you write 1 by 10 square 1 by 10 square denominator has positive power i want it in numerator means how can i write 10 power minus 2 understood children so like the easiest topic only based on that some laws of some rules are there in this topic that we will see here first of all using that formula or law we will solve the sums in exercise 12.1 understood what are the laws mentioned in this chapter See, loss of exponents. Loss nothing but formulae. See, there are six uh, formulae mentioned in this chart. The first one is a power m into a power n is equal to a power m plus n. What is given for? a power m into a power n is equal to a power m plus n. Here, this is exponential form. This is also exponential form. Here, base are a powers m and n actually how they connected here in multiple if in multiple if the base are same their power to be added about this we have seen in um, where squares and square roots in that topic itself uh, i have used this two formula many times clear a power m into a power n is equal to a power m plus n a power m plus n what is this meaning for in multiple if the bases are same power their power can be added for simplifying category we can use such formula okay then division wise a power m divided by a power n is equal to a power m minus n actually what are a m n a and b are see uh, here another b are also coming a and b are non-zero integers that means that a b value should not be taken as zero Z, uh, without zero other values can be occupied for a b okay so one day i have written here generally a and b are non-zero integers actually integers means you know positive negative together with the zero are called that collection of numbers is called the integer here a and b i have assumed as non-zero integers that means you should not take a and b values as zero clear m and n are natural numbers in any integers any integers natural numbers anyway you can tell m and n are any integers here sometimes zero also will come specific condition for a and b only non-zero n integers you have to select clear so come to second formula a a power m how do you read it pa? a power m divided by a power n is equal to a power m minus n what is the difference between both here 
uh, uh, operation is multiple here operation is division in multiple time if the bases are same their power can be added here in division if the bases are same their power can be subtracted difference between their powers to be taken as the resultant exponent clear okay then third law power of a power what is that power of a power a power m the whole power n power already in the inside the bracket itself there is a exponential form clear power notation is there for that one more power comes what to do at that time their power can be multiplied what to do their powers can be multiplied a power m the whole power n is equal to a power m into n simply m n clear power of a power a power m the whole power n is equal to a power m into n okay come to fourth law a power m into b power m is equal to a into b the whole power m how do you read this formula a power m into b power m is equal to a into b the whole power m actually what is the difference between the fourth law and the first law here also multiplication here also multiplication here base are same powers are different here base are different powers are same here base same time what i said their powers can be added here if you watch closely what do you observe their powers are same base are different so powers coming same time what to do that power can be taken as a common power for the product clear powers can be taken as the product common clear a power m into b power m is equal to a into b a b the whole power m in multiple if the bases are different powers are same that powers can be taken as the common power for the given product clear children like the same way in division also in division see be, powers are same bases are different like compare second and uh, fifth one a power m divided by a power n here a power m divided by b power m powers are same bases are different at the time what to do the power is common for both the division division of a by b clear a by b the whole power m clear children a power m divided by b power m is equal to a by b the whole power m a divided by b the whole power m for the given division their power is common understood the next one is a power 0 is equal to 1 anything power 0 whatever may be the base whatever may be the base if the power is zero the given value is totally equal to 1 okay anything power zero nothing but a power zero is equal to 1 clear children see one more formula what comes a power minus a. just now i negative power i told no i left that here what comes a power minus m is equal to 1 by a power plus m a power minus m is equal to 1 by a power plus m negative power how to change into positive power by uh, re uh, reciprocal clear a power minus m is equal to 1 by a power plus m powers with the negative exponent in the beginning of the class itself i have explained clear children see again i am recalling this a power m into a power n is equal to a power m plus n a power m divided by a power n is equal to a power m minus n a power m the whole power n is equal to a power m n a power m into b power m is equal to a b the whole power m a power m divided by b power m is equal to a by b the whole power m a power 0 is equal to 1 
um, which I left here a power minus m is equal to that means negative power how to change into positive power okay a power minus m is equal to 1 by a power plus m understood here a and b are non-zero integers m and n are any type of integers okay now using this last we are going to solve exercise sums okay see in exercise 12.1 first section evaluate exercise 12.1 first section simplest uh, calculation only first section evaluate see in that first question there is given number 3 power minus 2 how do you read it 3 power minus 2 clear in this actually this is in which form exponential form here 3 is called base power is called minus 2 that minus 2 is called here exponent especially negative exponent clear children 3 power minus 2 here exponent sign is negative okay we have to evaluate that means we have to simplify 3 power minus 2 what is the formula just now i told you know this minus power how do you change into plus power that means negative exponent how do you change into positive exponent what is the formula a power minus m is equal to 1 by a power plus m a power minus m is equal to 1 by a power plus m so using this law i am going to solve this okay 3 power minus 2 can be written as 1 by 3 power plus 2 as for this law clear children what law again i am telling a power minus m negative power actually a can be written as a by 1 understood or not a by 1 if you reciprocal means how comes 1 by a 1 by a the whole power plus m 1 power m nothing but 1 only 1 into 1 into 1 into etc m times it gives the meaning like that 1 power m simply can be written as uh, 1 so a power m a a a a a a into a into etc m times like that clear so how it is coming a power m sorry a power minus m is equal to 1 by a power plus m this one no need to add. actually one power m comes that value is one only so we are not entering there understood so using that law i can write this 3 power minus 2 as 1 by 3 power plus 2 3 square how do you read it 3 raised to the power 2 simply 3 square 2 power 2 has some special name already i told you in square root category squares chapter so 3 square clear so now 3 square can be written in multiple way 3 into 3 3 can be written in multiple way according to the number of power power is here 2 so 3 into 3 what answer will come 9 so answer for 3 power minus 2 is 1 by 9 understood actually what i did the minus power i changed as plus power plus exponent positive exponent wise i changed using the law okay here laws are very important okay based on that i changed this negative power as the positive power by reciprocaling that term and then that answer in product category clear 3 into 3 9 final answer for that question is 1 by 9 understood come to next question second question evaluate minus 4 the whole power minus 2 here base is minus 4 exponent is negative exponent that means power is minus 2 how do you change this minus into plus by reciprocal Apo minus 1, 4 can be written as minus 4 by 1 if you reciprocal how comes 1 by minus 4 while reciprocal in time this minus become plus 1 square no need so 1 only coming in numerator so 1 by minus 4 the whole square using the same law a power minus m is equal to 1 by a power plus m so minus became plus now what is this meaning minus 4 the whole square so minus 4 into minus 4 in the denominator clear minus into minus plus you know well 4 4 so 16 so 1 by 16 is the answer for this question so in this way you have to solve every question clear 
So if you see the third question, up to this you have seen the number here whole, here integer, here fractional base. Okay, 1 by 2 the whole power minus 5. 1 by 2 the whole power minus 5. Actually what is this meaning? 1 power minus 5 by 2 power minus 5. It, is, it gives like that only. If you want to change this negative exponent as the positive, what to do? a power minus m is equal to 1 by a the whole power plus m. That is the formula. Here actually our base itself in the fraction 1 by 2. If you reciprocal what comes 2 by 1. At the time the power become plus, positive, negative become positive. Okay, 1 by 2 the whole power minus 5 can be written as 2 by 1 the whole power plus 5. Understood? Okay, uh, uh, here again we can write as uh, fifth law we have seen no? a power uh, a by b the whole power m. What law we used here? A by, uh, a by b the whole power m is equal to a power m divided by b power m. Fifth law a by b the whole power m is equal to a power m divided by b power m. That common power you can take inside for numerator denominator separately clear a by b the whole power m is equal to a power m by b power m here a value is 2 uh, so 2 power 5 by b value is 1 1 power 5 nothing but 1 only no need to enter clear children so 2 by 1 the whole power 5 can be written as 2 power 5 by 1 power 5. 1 power 5 no need to enter because the value be always 1 only. 1 into 1 into 1. 5 times if you extend also in multiple category it become 1 only. So I taken directly. So 2 power 5 2 into 2 into 2. 2 power 5 can be written as 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2. Clear? 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. The base can be extended in product category according to their power. 2 power 5 meaning is like this only. So multiply 2 2s are 4, 4 2s are 8, 8 2s are 16, 16 2s are 32. So only I have written directly 2 power 5 become 32. Understood? So like this using the suitable law you have to solve the sum step by step. Second section. Simplify and express the result in power notation with the positive exponent. What they are telling, what they are mentioning here, condition. You have to simplify the given question and write the answer in power notation, especially with the positive exponent. Clear? So, power should be written in positive form. Okay. If you see in this section, there are five. First question I have taken, minus 4 by 4 sorry minus 4 the whole power 5 clear divided by minus 4 the whole power 8 see already I told you, this bracket comes the power is common for both inner part clear Sim 4 power 5 can be written without bracket but minus 4 power 5 actually this is the wrong manner you must cover them the given integer is minus 4 in the sense for taking that power you must cover it then only this power comes for both inner that means for this minus as well as this number 4 you should not write this minus 4 power 5 as simply like this without covering it is wrong it gives meaning the 5 is power 5 is common for only 4 not for minus it gives meaning like that so you must cover whenever negative power is coming at the time you must cover the number clear come to the topic minus 4 power 5 minus 4 the whole power 5 how do you read it pa minus 4 the whole power 5 divided by minus 4 the whole power 8 this is the question you have to simplify the given question and express it in power notation with the positive exponent this is the heading so what to do here how do you simplify which is the suitable law if, if operation is here division 
Base are same. So which is the suitable law? The second formula. What is that? A power m divided by A power n is equal to A power m minus n. Understood children? The in division, bases are same. Time which formula is suitable? The second law only. A power m divided by A power m divided by A power n is equal to A power m minus n. Here A is minus 4, m is 5, n is 8. Understood? So using that law, we can write this given question as in this form. Understood? A power 5, sorry, A, A power m divided by A power n is equal to A power m minus n. In the division, base are say power can be subtracted. So, minus 4 power 5 divided by minus 4 power 8 is equal to minus 4 the whole power 5 minus 8. According to the law, I have taken. So, plus 5 minus 8 integer calculation. Plus 5 minus 8. What comes? Minus 3 only. Minus 4 the whole power minus 3. Some over? No. What they said in the heading? You have to simplify the given question and express the answer in power form with a positive exponent. Okay. We have simplified it written in power form but our exponent is in negative negative exponent we got so change into positive exponent how a power minus m using this law a power minus m is equal to 1 by a power plus m so using this law this can be written in this way minus 4 the whole power minus 3 become 1 by minus 4 the whole power plus 3 only while reciprocal, uh, reciprocally, see this can be written minus 4 by 1. Yes or no? While reciprocal minus 4 by 1, it become 1 by minus 4. At the time, the negative power become positive power. Clear children? Keep it in mind. Inside the bracket, you should not change the sign. Minus 4 as it is minus 4 only. We are not going to change the base. Our motive, we have to change the air negative power to positive power for that the, to be reciprocal to the basis that's all we should not change that sign understood so minus 4 by uh, sorry minus 4 power minus 3 minus 4 the whole power minus 3 can be written as 1 by minus 4 the whole power plus 3 see heading simplify yeah we have simplified the question Express the answer in power notation. Yeah, power notation with the positive power. According to the question, we have solved. Clear? Come to second question. Here base are integer. Here base given in fractional. Say 1 by 2 cube the whole square. Actually, this is the base for this power. Clear? Compare this and this. In first question, 5 is the power, minus 4 is the base. Clear? Minus 4 is an integer. Here, 2 is the power, 1 by 2 cube is the base. Base is here, here given in fractional way. At the time, how to simplify? Clear? 1 by 2 cube, the whole square. Clear? So, um, how to simplify? See, um, we have seen fifth law. What law we have seen? Just now I explained here. A by B the whole power M. In division, power is common means that power can be taken, numerated, denominated separately. A power M divided by B power M. This is the meaning of this law. Clear? A by B the whole power M is equal to a power m divided by b power m. Using this law, I have written the step as in this way. See, 1 by 2 cube the whole square is equal to 1 square by 2 cube the whole square. Common power is here 2. 
that I have taken individually for numerator, denominator separately. Clear? According to this law, a by b the whole power m is equal to a power m by b power m. So based on that, how I wrote this step, 1 by 2 cube the whole square is equal to 1 square by 2 cube the whole square. Clear? 1 square, 1 into 1, 1 only. But come to denominator, 2 cube already base itself, in the base itself that is a power. Okay, 2 cube the whole square. Which law is suitable? Power of a power. A third law we have seen now, a power m, the whole power n is equal to a power m into n. Pa for, there is a power for that one more power comes. What to do? The both powers can be multiplied. So that is the meaning of that law. Okay, 2 cube the whole square equal to 2 power 3 into 2. 3 to are 6. a power m, the whole power n is equal to a power m into n. Clear? So that this 3 to are 6. So 2 cube the whole square can be written as 2 power 6. Already in the numerator 1. That's all. This is the answer for that. Clear? See, actually what I did, power of a power is there. So that formula we have to be used. 1 by 2 cube the whole square can be written as, based on this, 1 square by 2 cube the whole square. 1 square as it is 1. 2 cube the whole square means 2 powers are coming. At the time both can be multiplied. So 2 power 6. Clear? Third question. Minus 3 the whole power 4 into 5 by 3 whole power, whole power 4. In this situation we have to solve. How? Here if you consider this exponential form, minus 3 is the base that is integer. If you consider this 5 by 3 is the base that is fraction. Both connected in multiple. At that time we have to solve. What to do? See, minus 3 the whole power 4. Already I told it, bracket comes, the, you consider this 4 for, 4 is common for both inner parts. So, minus also to be multiplied 4 times. So, minus 1 into minus 1 into minus 1 into minus. Minus into minus plus, see, minus into minus into minus into minus. Minus into minus plus, plus into minus minus, minus into minus plus. Positive power comes, see, already I told this in rational number category, minus 1 power n. If the power n is odd, like 1, 3, 5, the answer is minus 1. Okay, see, minus into minus into minus, minus into minus plus, plus into minus minus. So, n is odd, answer is minus 1. N is even, answer is plus 1. Minus into minus into minus into minus. Here 4, 4 is the even number. Even power coming time, the product is positive category only. This we know well. So that this minus 3 into minus 3, the minus 3 power minus 3 the whole power 4 can be written as plus 3 power 4. Clear? How it is coming? This minus if you multiply 4 times it becomes plus. So 3 uh, plus 3 power 4 as it is I have taken here. Okay, come to second part. 5 by 3 whole power 4. In division power is coming uh, here as a common power. Common power means we can take into uh, separately numerator denominator wise. 5 by 3 the whole power 4 can be taken as 5 power 4 divided by 3 power 4. As for this law, a by b the whole power m is equal to a power m divided by b power m. Clear children, sum is simplest level only. But the way you are using the law is very important. Okay. Here just five or six laws are mentioned. That laws only often you are going to use. Repeatedly the six laws only often you are going to use. Very easiest level only. But you must understand while taking the minus, plus, power, 
changing into denominator there and all you have to concentrate properly clear so minus 3 the whole power 4 become plus 3 power 4 only because minus uh, 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 even power is coming the answer is positive 5 by 3 the whole power 4 can be written as 5 power 4 by 3 power 4 so at the time this step is coming 3 power 4 into 5 power 4 by 3 power 4 the one time this and this will be cancelled which is the remaining part 5 power 4 only as it is leave so final answer for this question is 5 power 4 understood and like this another two questions are there you try third section find the value of find the value of Side by side, copy down in your classwork neatly. See third section, find the value of. Find the value. First one, 3 power 0 plus 4 power minus 1 into 2 square. 3 power 0, 3 power 0 plus 4 power minus 1 into 2 square. Okay, this value you have to find out. See 3 power 0 plus 4 power minus 1. 3 power 0. What is that value? Already last based we have seen no, anything power 0 become 1. So using that formula a power 0 equal to 1. Using that law I can write here 3 power 0 as 1. Plus 4 power minus 1 negative exponent can be written this term as 1 by 4 plus 1. 4 power minus 1 means what is that meaning? 1 by 4 actually 4 by, 4 by 1 the whole power minus 1. This can be written by reciprocal 1 by 4 plus 1. So 4 power minus 1 can be written as 1 by 4 power plus 1 into 2 square. 2 to sir 4. Yes or no? 2 square means 2 into 2. 2 to sir 4. 4 power 1 can be written as 4. Now addition of these two numbers. Simplify. Cross multiply. If you take what comes? 1 into 4, 4. 4 plus 1, 5 by 4. This answer is 5 by 4. Into 4. Both will be cancelled. Final answer is 5 only. Clear children? The value of this is 5. What I did? 3 power 0 value taken as 1. Because of law. A power 0 equal to 1. This minus power. That means negative power. How to change into positive power? By reciprocal of that number. Okay. 4 power minus 1 can be written as 1 by plus 4. After that. Mixed fraction, so uh, take a cross multiple, 1, 4 is 4, 4 plus 1, 5, 5 by 4, into outside part, what is that, 2 square, nothing but 4, both 4s will be cancelled, the final answer is 4, clear? See, second question. power minus 1 divided by 2 power minus 2. All are negative powers only. 2 power minus 1 into 4 power minus 1 divided by 2 power minus 2. First solve the brackets. 2 power minus 1 can be written as 1 by 2. Yes or no? 4 power minus 1 also can be written as 1 by 
4 power plus 1 that 1 no need to enter 2 power minus 2 this also can be written as 1 by 2 power plus 2 that means 2 square now apply 2 power minus 1 in the place of that we can write this 1 by 2 multiple 4 power minus 1 at the time we can write 1 by plus 4 divided by 2 power minus 2 time that that value 1 by 2 square clear multiple only no need to take LCM so 1 into 1 1 2 4 are 8 divided by 1 by 2 square nothing but 4 division of 2 fractions is the reciprocal of multiplication you know well so 1 by 8 multiple by what is this reciprocal of the second part 4 by 1 so simplify 1 4 is 4 2 4 are 8 final answer is 1 by 2 like this step by step you have to solve see next to sum I am taking fifth question remaining two questions you have to try what is fifth question minus 2 by 3 the whole power minus 2 third section fifth one minus 2 by 3 the whole power minus 2 for that one power minus 2 by 3 the whole power minus 2 the whole square okay how to solve see minus 2 by 3 the whole power minus 2 equal to see this minus 2 my actually first inner part take after that you will consider this okay minus 2 negative power negative power first of all you have to change into positive power by uh, using which law a power minus m is equal to 1 by a power plus m using this law this can be written as 3 by minus 2 the whole power plus 2 clear minus 2 by 3 the whole power minus 2 can be written as 3 by minus 2 the whole power plus 2 using this law for that one more power clear now power of a power no Power, there is a power for that one more power so using a power m the whole power n a power m n using this law it can be written as 3 by minus 2 the whole power 2 into 2 4 clear now here which formula a by b the whole power m is equal to a power m by b power m using this formula this step can be written as 3 power 4 by minus 2 the whole power 4 ok up to this what I did question A in the given question if you consider the base itself fraction for that there is a negative power for that one more power is there power of a power clear so first if you consider the inner part our motive we have to change this negative power as the positive power for that reciprocal work you know the formula so at that time what I wrote minus 2 by 3 the whole power minus 2 as plus 3 the whole by minus 2 the whole power plus 2 understood if you consider the out power outside the power power of a power using this formula this can be multiplied so how comes this step 3 by minus 2 the whole power 2 into 2 4 after that if you watch actually uh, basis in division this by this for the common power is there so take the fifth law a by b the whole power m is equal to a power m by b power m using this formula we can take this 4 uh, power 4 into julie for numerator denominator separately now we have to find this value you know so 
we, uh, don't stop up to this we have to expand so 3 power 4 can be written as 3 into 3 into 3 into 3 by here minus minus 1 the whole power even power become positive sign only minus into minus into minus into minus 4 even power means just now I explained it it gives positive value only so leave it so 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 minus into minus plus plus into minus 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 into minus again plus so I left that minus here understood so what comes 3 3 is are 9 9 3 is are 27 27 3 is are 81 by 2 2 is are 4 4 2 is are 8 8 2 is are 16 so and value for this question is 81 by 16 understood so like this remaining two questions are there you have to solve come to fourth one evaluate 8 power minus 1 into 5 cube by 2 power minus 4 fourth Roman there are two questions I am trying one question you try one Eight power minus one into five cube by two power minus four. Clear? Eight power minus one into five cube by two power minus four. Want to do? You have to evaluate. You have to find its value. So first. This neg our motive negative power should be changed as positive power. Yes or no? So 8 power minus 1 can be written as 1 by 8 power plus 1. 5 cube already positive power only. So no need to touch this. 2 power minus 4. 2 power minus 4 can be written as 1 by 2 power plus 4. Yes or no? So 8 power minus 1 in the place of this I can write this value 1 by 8. 8 power 1 no need to mention the least power 1 into 5 cube as it is. So numerator came to denominator into 2 power minus 4 it is already in denominator. So 2 power minus 4 can be written as 1 by 2 power plus 4. Actually, already that is in denominator case. For that one more fraction coming time, it is automatically going to reciprocally. So, it goes to numerator. Clear? So, 5 cube, 1 into 5 cube, 5 cube. Into this part goes to numerator, 2 power 4 by this 8. Clear children, what I did? 8 power minus 1 can be written as 1 by 8 power plus 1. 5 cube already in positive case so it comes in numerator place as it is don't touch that but denominator 2 power minus 4 can be written as actually 2 by 1 it comes like this 2 by 1 become 1 by 2 no so already it is in denominator position so 1 by 2 power plus 4 like that I wrote in the first step fraction already in denominator for that one more so automatically it goes to reciprocally to numerator place so i have written this 2 power 4 as here understood now you have to simplify 5 cube 5 into 5 into 5 any uh, simplification any possibility to cancel yeah this can be written 2 power 4 can be written as 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 by 8 understood 1 2 is to 4 2 are 8 1 2 is to 2 2 are 4 1 2 is to 1 2 is to which is remainder 2 only remainder here so 5 5 are 25 25 5 is 125 125 5 is uh, 125 into 2 nothing but 250 clear so like this you have to step by step solve what i did first of all see the question there are two negative powers change into positive power apply in the proper places enter properly then step by step simplify you will get the answer 250 clear 
ओके वन मोर क्वेश्चन इज देर इन दिस रोमन यू ट्रै कम टू फिफ्त क्वेश्चन फिफ्त सेक्शन फैंड द वैल्यू ऑफ एम फार विच फाइव पवर एम डिवेड बै फाइव पवर मैनस् थ्री इज ईक्वल टू फाइव पवर फाइव वाट इज गिवेन सीम फिफ्त वन फाइव पवर एम डिवेड बै फाइव पवर मैनस् थ्री इज ईक्वल टू फाइव पवर फाइव This is the question. In this, they are telling us to find this power m. M value we have to find. Up to this power given directly uh, using the integer. Here in general they given five uh, power m. Find that value m. Value of m they are asking. What to do? Say five power m divided by five power minus three is equal to five power five. See in divi, if you consider the operation in the question division, in division base are same. So that means what do you know? A power m divided by a power a power n is equal to a power m minus n. Yes or no? In division. Base are same. Power can be subtracted using second law. So what I am going to do? So this left side part I am going to write like this: five power m minus of minus three. Why I wrote like this? Division. Division means powers can be subtracted. So m minus for that subtraction, uh, this minus came. But n value itself minus, so this minus came. Don't confuse seeing two minus together. Clear? Division base are same. Power can be subtracted. So m minus subtraction. So minus. N value in the question itself minus three. So this minus is coming here. Clear? So five power m minus of minus three is equal to what is at right hand side? Five power five. See, both are equal. Here five chalk pieces. Here five chalk pieces. Both are equal. So if the bases are same, that powers also same. We have to consider like that. So the bases are same in the sense the powers also equal. So that I am taking their powers only now. M minus of minus three is equal to this five. Their powers only taken separately because both are equal. Clear? Base are same in the sense their powers also same. So m uh, m into minus into minus minus into minus plus one, you know. So m plus three is equal to five. Uh, we need m value. So linear equation you know to solve. So this plus three to be taken that side at the time it goes. Five minus three is equal to two. So m value is here two. M power two divided by m power minus three is equal to m power five. Clear? You can verify that putting two in that m place. It comes correctly at right side. Clear? So m value is two. What I did? I have taken second law. A power m divided by a power n is equal to a power m minus n. Based on that, power can be subtracted. So I wrote like this. That side also base are same. <coughs> Both are equal. So the power step only I have taken and simply simplified it. Final answer for m is two. Understood? Sixth section. Two questions are there. One I am trying. You try another one. First one I am trying. One by three, the whole power minus one. One by three, the whole power minus one, minus half. One by four, the whole power minus one. For that, minus one. Okay, all are negative powers. Okay. 
see 1 by 3 the whole power minus 1 minus 1 by 4 the whole power minus 1 the whole power minus 1 so step by step solve heading is simplify what to do first to take inner part 1 by 3 the whole power minus 1 this can be written as 1 by 3 the whole power minus 1 negative power no what to do 3 by 1 the whole power plus 1 comes 3 by 1 can be written simply as 3 power 1 nothing but 3 see negative power I have changed into positive power 1 by 3 can be written as 3 by 1 the whole power positive 1 3 power 1 by 1 power 1 1 power 1 nothing but 1 only so final answer for this 3 only like that 1 by 4 1 by 4 the whole power minus 1 negative power to be changed into positive power for that this to be reciprocal 1 by 4 can be written as 4 by 1 the whole power plus 1 this power can be written as 4 power 1 by 1 power 1 1 power 1 nothing but 1 only so final answer for this is 4 okay so in the place of 1 by 3 the whole power minus 1 I can write 3 minus write the question one time 1 by 3 the whole power minus 1 my 1 by 4 the whole power minus 1 overall my power minus 1 for the first part 1 by 3 power minus 1 whole power minus 1 what value we found it 3 minus minus 1 by 4 the whole power minus 1 what answer 4 clear so, seeing the sum only this much but nothing is there simplest topic okay for that overall whole power minus 1 okay 3 minus 1 minus 1 plus 3 minus 4 if you solve what do you get minus 1 only minus 1 the whole power minus 1 clear here what do you write how do you change into positive by reciprocal okay a power minus m is equal to 1 by a power plus m anyhow minus 1 power minus 1 min 1 by minus 1 power plus 1 nothing but 1 by minus 1 final answer 1 divided by 1 1 only no so minus 1 is the answer clear minus 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 what to do step by step you have to solve clear final answer for this question is minus 1 that's all one more question like this only you try 7th part that's our last section simplify first one 25 int t power minus 4 by 5 power minus 3 into 10 into t power minus 8 condition they told t is not equal to 0 why because t is coming in denominator already in rational case itself i told rational number can be written in the form of p by q where p and q are integers q is not equal to 0 denominator number should not be equal to 0 so in that basis only denominator this is a fractional number here t is not equal to 0 why they mentioned this condition you know denominator in rational number category denominator should not be equal to 0 so only they mentioned the given denominator t should not be equal to 0 clear this we have to simplify don't see i am checking again 25 into t power minus 4 5 power my by 5 power minus 3 into 10 into t power minus 8 we have to simplify how to simplify 25 into t power minus 4 by 5 power minus 3 into 10 into t power minus 8 simplify using suitable formula before going to use formula both are multiples of 5 no just to try to solve directly 5 5 are 25 2 5 are 10 clear now that's all here t power 4 using formula only we can simplify okay come to here this 5 can be written as 5 power plus 1 
into this t t can be taken together t power minus 4 divided by t power minus 8 base are same in division okay come to here which i left that is number 2 here 5 power minus 3 5 power ma minus 3 into 2 is coming clear okay now 5 2 only has no pair here so leave it but this 5 can be written in this way no so we can write 5 power 1 by 5 power minus 3 having same basis into 1 by 2 this 2 1 by 2 into here t power minus 4 by t power minus 8 i have grouped the bases okay same basis based i have combined them now here in division base are same power can be subtracted using that law i can write here 5 power 1 minus of minus 3 a power m divided by a power n is equal to a power m minus n here n value is minus 3 as it is m value is plus 1 into 1 by 2 into here this here also division only division base are same so power can be subtracted t power minus 4 minus of minus 8 now minus into minus plus no so pi 5 power 1 minus into minus plus this 3 into 1 by 2 into t power minus 4 minus into minus plus 8 1 plus 3 4 1 by 2 into here plus 8 minus 4 that means t power plus 4 only so t value we don't know no so as it is you keep 5 power 4 into t power 4 by 2 this is the final answer if you can write like this also 5 t the whole power 4 by 2 this is correct this is also correct i have taken this power as a common because same power no 5 power 4 into t power 4 can be written as 5 into t the whole power 4 by 2 as it is this is the answer for this question Okay, like this, one more question is there, you have to solve. Okay, exercise 12.1 over. Additionally, 12.2 is there. E is yes to 1, just one mark level. How to read and write the larger numbers using exponents and powers easily? Based on that, few questions are there in 12.2. That also we will see now. exercise 12.2 okay see before going to see this exercise just I am introducing how to write larger number easily using exponents see for example 10 if you take 10 can be written as 1 into 10 power 1 yes or no 100 can be written as 100 in, uh, 100 means 10 into 10 no beginning of the class i have explained it again i am telling 100 can be written as 10 into 10 10 square also correct this we can write 1 into 10 square that also correct 1000 10 cube can be written as 1 into 10 cube clear actually these are the whole numbers this is exponential form the way of writing the whole number in this form is called standard form or scientific form. What is this? 1 into 10 cube, 1 into 10 power. Having the exponential form in the product with the base 10 is called scientific form or exponential, sorry, standard form of the numbers. Clear? What is this name of SLE? standard form or scientific notation actually what is this meaning we can using the exponents exponents and powers we can read and write the larger numbers easily example mass of the earth 
weight of the uh, distance between the earth and the sun okay long distances have comes bigger level no that uh, numbers and all can be written in scientific notation easily actually what is scientific notation that means uh, what is another name standard form what is the standard form any number can be written in the product with the exponential form of the number having the base 10 is called scientific notation or standard form clear children what i'm telling any number any number two three four like that any number can be written in product notation with the exponential form having the base 10 is called scientific notation or standard form see here positive power is coming so thousand means as actually whole number thousand means whole number this can be written as in decimal how in which way you can write thousand point zero correct or wrong thousand is a whole number this can be written in decimal form like this thousand point zero at the time point is right side yes or no so i want this point to here want to move here so three digits one two three three digits i have to move means i can write like this 1 into 1.0 or simply 1 1 into 10 power plus 3 1000 is equal to 1000 standard form which way like this only 1 time 10 cube 1 into 10 cube only 1000 1000 can be written in decimal form in this way 1000.0 think and why i am talking again again here because some decimal points will arise in next category so that one i am telling here point is at your right hand side so right to left point moving means in the exponential form power comes positive category understood see one more number 10000 this can be written as 10 power 4 1 uh, 10 into 10 into 10 into 10 only 10 power 4 clear this 10 power 4 can be written in standard form standard form means any 1 time 10 power 4 no so 1 is coming 1 into 10 power 4 this is the standard form of the whole number 10,000 at the time think where is the point this whole number can be written as decimal like this 10,000.0 this is a decimal notation of this whole number 10,000 clear at this time think your point is at right side so right I want this point to here a moving how many digits at back 1 2 3 4 right to left you are sitting the point at the time moving how many digits 4 digits so this can be written this way 1 into see 1.0 1.0 nothing but 1 1.0 into 10 power plus 4 you moved the point from your right hand side to right hand side to left hand side having four digits moving four digits 1 2 3 4 so plus 4 came understood or not see in this basis one more number i am giving 1 2 3 4 5 6 this is the whole number consider where is the point there is no point in the whole number means you have to think the point is at right hand side i want to move this point from here to left side near one moving how many digits at back one two three four five six so what is the standard form can be written as 1.0 into 10 power right to left you moved so plus six understood this is the standard form of the bigger number this one clear so in this basis we are going to work out so 12 point two possibly negative exponent also will come i am telling see 10 10 power 1 positive 1 this suppose 10 power minus 1 means how comes 1 by 10 power 1 actually 1 by 10 what is this meaning 0 0.1 no decimal value 10 power minus 2 can be written as 10 power plus 2 10 square 10 square means nothing but 1 by 100 10 into 10 
at the time what is this decimal expansion for zero two digits means two decimal part you must have so 0.01 10 cube clear 1 uh, 10 power minus 3 10 power 1 by 10 power plus 3 that means 1 by 1000 1000 three digits three decimal sorry three zeros in denominator come in time what is the decimal expansion 0 0.001 just observe what i did it. in denominator 10 means one, one zero means one decimal part two zeros means two decimal part three zeros means three decimal parts so de de dividing time your point is moving from which side up? See, it's going left side. Yes or no? Now, in this situation, I have to write this form in standard form. How? Now, 0 0.1 can be written in whole. How can I write? I have to multiply by 10. Yes or no? Multiply means point will go here. By 10 means 1 0 will move. At the time it comes 1.0 something. 1.0. So left to right you are moving the point. Left to right you are moving. Just now we have seen right to left means positive power. Now oppositely left to right you are moving. 0 0.1 if you multiply by 10 it become 1.0 in that situation to be written that number as the standard form standard form means how can i write 1.0 into 10 power how you move the point from the original position of the here point to right side you moved 0 0.1 written as 1.0 moved one digit left to right so negative one clear like this here you are moving from left to right so 1.0 into 10 power left to right so minus 2 here how comes 10 um, 1.0 into 10 power 3 digit you moved left to right so minus 3 this is the procedure for writing any bigger number using uh, exponents and powers with the standard form clear Again, I am telling right to left while moving the point, you must write the power notation in positive case. Left to right, if you move the point while writing standard form, it must be written in negative power. Clear? That's all procedure based on this 12.2 exercise we are going to see now. See, in exercise 12.2, first question, express the following numbers in standard form. Express the following number in standard form or scientific notation also correct. Okay. Here, first one, there are five questions. 0, 0.00, num while taking this type of numbers that means larger numbers you must take carefully the number of zeros okay don't leave any one zero one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven eleven zeros in middle one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven after that only eight five Clear. So this much can you read this 0 0.000085 well, it takes uh, it is not convenient to read such numbers. So we have to write this in standard form. Standard form how do you write? Standard form means what I told you any whole number can be written in product with the exponential form having the base 10. So in that, that is the standard form. So here how do you write? I have to move the point. Whole number means 8.5. 8. Having whole number 8 I have to keep here. After that 0.5 comes. So I have to move the point from here to there. Having uh, moving how many digits? From left to right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 
so my standard form for this number is 8.5 i want 85 also can be kept i am keeping here so um, just how many digits you moved that only you have to keep in counting so 8.5 into 10 power exponential form now so into 10 power how many digits moved from left to right so left to right means negative power arise 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 so minus 12 one more question that's all standard form of this decimal number is this one 8.5 into 10 power minus 12 understood see second question 0 0.0000 Here also 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 11 zeros. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. After that only number 9, 4, 2. This to be written in standard form. So I have to move the digits from here to that means left to right side. Uh, after 9 that means standard form is 9.42 into 10 power uh, 11 zeros with 1 9 so minus 12 12 digits are moved point moved from left to right 12 digits after so standard form of this number is 9.42 into 10 power minus 12 okay one more question fifth question whole number wise i am taken 3 1 8 6 with uh, how many zeros 1 2 3 4, 5, 6, 7, 7 zeros. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and then this number. Okay, uh, this to be written in standard form. Up to this, we have seen decimal numbers. So, point moved left to right. Left to right in this means exponential form negative came. Negative power came. Here, this is a whole number. So, what I told already, whole number means you must think point is at your right hand side like this so you are moving the point from right to left right to left means positive power comes that's all so answer is 3.186 in 10 power how many digits you have moved right hand side means 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 here you are bringing so positive 10 3.186 into 10 power plus 10. Right to left means positive power. Left to right means negative power. Keep it in mind. That's all first section over. Second section, oppositely they are asking. Second section, the, actually this is a useful, useful form that we have written in standard form now oppositely question is given in standard form they are telling us to write them in usual form usual form usual form means normal this is usual form clear first question 3.02 into 10 power minus 6 10 power minus 6 that to be written in usual usual means how comes 3 point power is negative power negative means point uh, that means the like this 0 0.000 so what is this meaning actually Ten, uh, say for understanding purpose we can go directly within a line we can get this answer for you understanding purpose purpose i am making this deeply see 3 point 0 2 into 10 power minus 6 can be written as 10 power plus 6 what is this meaning? 3.02 by 6 zeros with 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This is the meaning of this question. You have to divide this decimal number by this much. At the time, already one digit is there. 6 digits means 6 part. You have to move the decimal point at left. Yes or no? 1 by 10 means can be written as 0 0.1. 1 by 100 in the sense 1, 0 0.01 1 0 1 decimal digit 2 zeros 2 decimal digits like that 1 2 3 4 5 6 zeros means 6 decimal digits you have to move the point already there is a whole number you have to move one digit here 
so remaining five zeros there are no numbers so you have to fill them by putting zeros so what is the answer means 0 0.0006 zeros means 1 2 3 4 5 for sixth zero there is one number in the question itself so as it is the decimal part will arise so this is the usual form for this question clear children six zeros one two three four five six so our original point in the question is here so six digit you have to move the point from there to left so one two three four five six this is the way of keeping see three point zero two into ten power minus six is standard form that to be written in usual form for un uh, this steps and all not necessary directly we can make this for understanding purpose how the answer is coming so i have explained 10 power minus 6 can be written as positive way 1 by 10 power 6 10 power 6 can be written in denominator in this way so this to be divided by this division means point can be moved no need to divide like this so directly you can make like this understood see one more question positive power wise second question 4.5 into 10 power 4 4.5 into 10 power 4 positive power so what is this meaning 4.5 into 10 power 4 means 10,000 comes this and all no need directly we can move the point right side okay but for understanding purpose I am making because this is one mark question no need this much steps 4.5 into 10 power 4 10 power 4 nothing but 10,000 no now this to be multiplied this at the time point move move from here to right side yes or no see four zeros means four digits it to be moved from here to right side already one digit is there so remaining three zeros only you have to fill so four forty five with the three zeros so point places here after multiplying this number by ten thousand point came to right hand side of here okay understood see one more question third one 3 into 10 power minus 8 here how do you go negative power so point goes to left hand side like this so directly we can write 3 um, see 0.0, 0 already one day, whole number part is there yeah, minus 8 means 8 digits you have to move already one digit is there so 7 zeros 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 with this 3. This is the answer. See, minus 8 means in decimal part 8 digits you must have. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Coming correctly. Uh, uh, yeah, for this, one uh, 3 is there, that one. Understood? How it is coming? This is the direct answer. Minus 8 means point goes left side. Plus 8 means point goes right side. This is the procedure. Okay. How it is coming? I am proving. See 3 into 10 power minus 8 can be written as 10 power plus 8. That means 3 into 10 power 8 zeros. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. This divided by this means automatically point will go like this. At the time you will get this answer. answer. Understood? That's all children. Third section also the same way only you try. Fourth question. In a star, there are five books, each of thickness 20 millimeter and five paper sheets, each of thickness 0.016 millimeter. What is the total thickness of the stock? In the stock, there are five books. One word problem given in this question. See, this is books, five books here. Each one, each book thickness is 20 millimeter. For the, here, paper, paper seeds, paper seeds, how many means five? 
each paper thickness also 0.016 millimeter that means what is the total this plus this they are asking clear children in the stock there are five books each book thickness is 20 millimeter pa five paper seats each paper thickness is 0.016 millimeter what is the total thickness this is the question what to do book means one book thickness is 20 millimeter that means five books thickness what comes 5 into 20 millimeter no 5 into 20 millimeter what comes 100 millimeter 5 paper seats each paper seat thickness only this man this one so 5 seats thickness what comes 5 into 0 point 0 0.016 0 0.016 millimeter multiply what comes 5 6 are 30 remainder 3 5 1 is 5 plus 5 1 is 5 5 plus 3 8 5 0 0 this one comes 0 0.080 millimeter total total thickness add 100 millimeter plus 0 0.080 millimeter 100 can be written as 100.00 for, for arrangement decimal basis. Okay. 100 millimeter plus 0 0.080 millimeter. What answer will come? 0 080.001. 0 100.080 millimeter. This is usual answer. They are asking in exponential, that means standard form. How do you write in standard form? I, I want to move this point from here to here, right to left, that means positive power comes. So, this can be written as, one, 100 can be written as 10 square, no? So, 1.00, that 0 0.080 into 10 square millimeter. Okay, the thickness of 5 books and 5 paper seats are 1.00080 into 10 square millimeter. Understood? That's all children. 2 exercise completed. Chapter also that much only. Small, smallest topic. Okay, completed. Just to throw the last. The 5 or 6 last only repeatedly comes while solving the sums. Take practice, worksheet also will come side by side, complete your class work. Thank you, Pa.